What's up? So I just got home from work, figured it's gonna be raining tomorrow. So I was like, hey, let's do something. Let's get some content out there. So probably, you know, short but helpful video today. We're gonna go over the Melon, the Milan, Melon, however you wanna say it. The GPS, uh, several out there, but this one is like 30 bucks. Do the same thing and you know, it says the mile per hour too. It says the kilometers on there, but you can preset it to miles per hour. So that's what we're gonna go over today. And then we're gonna take Uno, Dos, Trece with us and do a little speed run. See what it comes back as. But uh, we're gonna leave this one in the box because we still gotta do a review on that. And of course, this bad boy is gonna get its own review, so. But yeah, so let's 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 jump into it. So yeah, the uh, thirty dollar uh, GPS uh, from Amazon. You can get it on Amazon, thirty bucks. Um, you can get it in white, black, red, and of course, I got it in red. And let me tell you why, because if you ever have a wreck doing a speed run and your stuff goes flipping through the grass. All right. You might be able to find this a little better uh, in the grass if it ever comes off. So if I was you, I'd get red. But yeah, it's real simple. Power button on the left. Okay. Power button on the left. Mash it. Comes in. Um, I already set mine to miles per hour. You can see miles per hour. Um, the green light flashing means it's a uh, battery's charged, or it's actually flashing means it's searching for uh, it's first searching for a signal. Uh, once you put it out, once you're outside, I'm in my basement, but once you're outside and you got this strapped to whatever you're gonna run it down the road with, right there. Okay, see it found it. You hear it lock? It beeped. All right, that means it's got a it's got a lock on a satellite. So it's ready to go. Um, mash the little button on the back. Uh, you can go in and set your time zone if you want to, because then you can go through all these different things. I mean, honestly, I bought this to use the mile per hour. That's it. I don't really care what else it's got. Uh, it comes with a book. It comes with a book in here if you want to use it for other stuff. Um, there you go. But... Uh, it's got some rubber bands, which I think are too thick, unless you're gonna put it to a bike. Uh, charger, and then you got your little, uh, where you hook the rubber bands to. But yeah, set it to your time zone if you want to, so it'll have the time on it. <clears throat> um, go in, change it to miles per hour, and then that's that's basically what, I, that's all I'm using it for is mile per hour. Um, so, uh, don't really need to know a whole lot about it. Wait until the green light is locked in and you got good signal. So then strap it to a bad boy and haul butt down the road. And then when you come back, um, it'll, tell you, it'll tell you how fast you went and then hold the right button down. That means save. Do you wanna save it, yes or no? This is yes, this is no. I hit no, it resets, it goes back to zero. Strap it to another one and zoom. Keep going, see how fast. Each thing you have can be, or is be. There it is, GPS. Now let's go have some fun. Oh yeah, and one more thing. So everybody wants to usually like, get some kind of double-sided sticky tape, okay? And then put a piece here, and then stick this here, and then block it off, and then when you pull it off, you got some kind of sticky. Okay, if you wanna do that, fine, it's yours. But this thing right here, okay, goes on the back of here. Put that thing on there like that, locks in. Like that ain't coming off. Then, buy some rubber bands, okay? Assorted, advantage, rubber bands, or whatever. It don't matter, I got those at Walmart. Okay, use the thick ones if you want to, or the thin ones, okay? Wrap that thing around here like this, all right? Put that thing right here, like that, get it going, okay? Wrap it around, put it on there. Perfect. 
that thing ain't going nowhere. All right, so if you want to use double-sided sticky tape, you can, or you can just use rubber bands, because I mean, you're not going to be out there trying to jump stuff or hopefully not be doing speed runs in the grass. So if everything goes good, that'll come back to you. So yeah, uh, rubber bands, do it on small ones, big ones. I mean, anything you want to, but do whatever you want, but let's go. All right, we're here. Right across the street from the his house. So this is where we'll do most of the speed runs until uh, they get really, really fast. All the way down through there, come down through here. But uh, yeah, let's get these things out. All right, let's see, which one we wanna do first? I think I wanna do the legend first because uh, it's just been, it's been seeming like it's getting slower to me. So we're gonna do that. See what we get out of it. Fresh batteries, they all got fresh batteries. So let's go. All right, so got it on there. I'm gonna zero this thing out. Remember, like I said, this is a zero button, okay? Zero it out, no save. Um, I'm actually gonna cut it off and cut it back on because the green light wasn't on. Okay, see it's flashing? All right, and it locked in. So if the green light ain't on, you can always just uh, restart the whole thing. All right. Okay. It's on zero. Let's see what we got on the legend. All right, 19.6 miles an hour. Not bad. 19.6. All right. So, all right, 19.6 on that one. And let's, uh, let's, uh, no, put it down. I'm curious to see what this little baby does, honestly. All right, come here. It's already hit 12. What? All right. No. Zero it out. Let's get it. Getting a little, getting a little squirrely. <laughs> Dang, 25.2. Let's do that one one more time. Got a little squirrely. No. All right, ready? Oh, oh no. A little blooper. There's your little blooper. Come on. All right, ready? This little thing right here, boy, it likes to ride wheelies. Come here. Yep, 25. He said 25.2 last time, 25.1 this time. All right, that's all right. I can deal with that. One more to do today. All right. All right, we're good. And guys, I'm really excited to do this one because this, like I said, this little bad boy right here, that's going to be the experimental 
car for the channel. So we need to get a starting point on this puppy. And then we're just gonna see how far we can take it. I ain't gonna lie, I like this car. It's probably one of my faves. It's just fun to drive. What do we got? 30, all right. 30.9. All right, let's get one more on this thing, because like I said, I wanna know where we're at with this puppy, because it's only gonna get faster. All right. Well, sometimes that happens in a speed. Oh, look, the GPS stayed on. See, that's what I was talking about. Rubber bands. You don't need sticky tape to get everywhere. Sticky on this, sticky on that. 31.1, and that was the fastest one. Let's go. All right, so brought a few cars out today. Hit the strip up a little bit, ran over my big toe. God, that thing hurt. I ain't lying. But, uh, yeah. So, that was pretty cool. Uh, got some starting points on the uh, purple car. And that's what I really wanted to do. Because I am ready to get inside that thing. And start swapping motors. And swapping gears. And swapping ESCs. So, we're going to just see how fast we can get that thing. But, uh, yeah. We're going to load this stuff up and get back to the house. Uh Man, I tell you what, I cannot wait to do the speed run on that uh, Typhoon. So, uh, but yeah, y'all stay tuned. Crazy stuff coming. Just trying to get y'all some content out there. But uh, we appreciate y'all. We'll see y'all next time.